We're here with head men's basketball coach Rich Ryder as he enters his 21st year at the helm of the Kingsmen. Coach, you earned a share of the Sky title last season, but lost leading scorers Eric Smith and Coltrane Paldrill. What will be uh, the key for the team this year to c continue your success? No question, they'll, they'll leave a hole for us to, to fill. But I, after going through the early practice, I don't think that hole is going to be as deep as people think. Uh, we've had some really good pr uh, practices. We've had some players that have been on the team in the past, and now they're ready to step up, and we feel very good uh, about uh, our our task right now of going into uh, the Sky Conference to, to compete. Uh, we've had three or four people to step up that have been with us for four or five, uh, <laughs> for four or five months now, and uh, they're ready to, to help fill the goal that was left by uh, Coltrane and Eric. What are some of the strengths that you've seen from this group so far during the preseason practices? This is a very close-knit group. Uh, they play very hard. I think our depth will be more than uh, it has been in the past. I don't think we have to rely on one or two people this year. I think we're going to have uh, several people step up and uh, take the responsibility. Uh, that's nice. We have uh, excellent leadership in, in Dan Wade uh, and, and Connor uh, McGuire. They've shown excellent leadership uh, both on and off the floor, so we fully expect them to be our leaders. But at the same time, uh, we've had a very good recruiting year. Uh, that we feel good about uh, for their development as the season progresses. And you mentioned uh, Dan Wade and Connor McGuire. Who will be some of the other key returners as well as uh, some of those newcomers who will make an impact? I think Jacob Dow has made the, the, the commitment to be uh, a much, much better player. He came to us very young, but I think he's going to be a force for us as the season uh, progresses. Uh, he's a big body in there. Uh, we got a, uh, Curtis uh, Upshaw that's going to be a good basketball player for us, that he's finally stepped up and, and is going to assume a, a much bigger role than in, in the past right now. No question uh, about Sam Cirillo. He's uh, bided his time, and now he's ready to step up, and he'll play a very key role, as well as uh, Lenaki. He's going to come along and, and uh, uh, be a force for us and, and spell us at the guard spot. All right, and finally, what are some goals and expectations that you have for the team this year? Right now we're going to try to be as competitive as we possibly can. We have a very challenging schedule, but I think it's going to be one that will uh, get us ready for conference play come January. Uh, I fully expect us to, uh, to be very competitive with just about everyone on our uh, squad this year. Uh, we definitely want to uh, be a, we're going to be a team-oriented uh, basketball team this year where we don't have to rely on one or two individuals. We're going to be able to uh, share the responsibility. And that's been kind of our key topic all along is to uh, share the basketball, share the responsibility, and uh, let's do it together as a team. Thank you very much, Coach, and good luck this season. Thank you.